news and updates on your favorite shows and celebrities. Today, we're going to talk about Matthew McConaughey's potential role in the Yellowstone universe, and why it might not happen after all. But before we get into that, make sure you hit the like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Now, let's get started. As you may have heard, earlier this year, Deadline reported that Matthew McConaughey was in talks to join a new spin-off series from Yellowstone, titled 2024. This show would star McConaughey as the lead character, and would air after Yellowstone wraps up its final season in 2024. This news was met with excitement by many fans, especially those who were disappointed by the rumors of Kevin Costner leaving Yellowstone. I mean, who wouldn't want to see McConaughey play a cowboy in a modern-day Western drama? He already won an Oscar for his amazing performance in Dallas Buyers Club, where he portrayed a rodeo cowboy who contracted HIV. He has that charisma and charm that would fit perfectly in the Yellowstone world. However, it seems like there are some major obstacles in the way of this deal, and McConaughey might actually walk away from the project if he doesn't get what he wants. According to various sources, McConaughey is asking for a huge salary of $2.5 million per episode. Yes, you heard that right. $2.5 million for each episode. He and his team believe that he is the key to the success of the spin-off, and that he deserves to be paid accordingly. He also claims that taking on this role would put his movie career on hold, so he wants to be compensated for that as well. On the other hand, Paramount is having second thoughts about paying McConaughey such a high amount. They are wondering if he is really worth it, and if he can bring in enough viewers to justify the cost. They are also comparing him to other actors who have starred in Yellowstone-related shows, such as Harrison Ford and Helen Mirren, who reportedly received $1 million per episode for 1923, a prequel series that aired in 2023. Even Kevin Costner, who was the main star of Yellowstone, was getting $1.3 million per episode in 2022. So, McConaughey's demand seems to be a lot more than what Paramount is used to paying. As a result, the negotiations between McConaughey and Paramount have been dragging on for a long time, and there is a real possibility that they will fall apart. If that happens, McConaughey might just move on to another project, and we might never see him in the Yellowstone universe. That would be a shame, because I think he would be a great addition to the franchise, and I would love to see him interact with some of the original characters from Yellowstone, hopefully Beth and Rip included. But what do you think? Do you think McConaughey deserves to get paid $2.5 million per episode? Do you think he has the same star power as Jennifer Aniston and Reese Witherspoon, who are getting $2 million per episode for the morning show on Apple TV? Do you think he would make a good cowboy in 2024? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like and share this video, and subscribe to Prime Promo for more videos like this. See you soon.